Exactly. No. So, sir, let we, me make one no, point. No, no, that, no, no, one, we, one we let the sir, I want to make one thing very clear. One sec, one sec. We, no, I don't, don't believe. One, 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 one I don't believe in these statistics. One Five, no, one sec, Mr. Mungekar, I'm an arm admin. I am not an economist, but even an arm admin knows that your eight percent growth was on the back of a economic stimulus. Please don't deny that. But that was that was wrong. So don't was it was it wrong? Well, it's a brought down to six percent. No, so stimulus don't don't say eight percent, seven percent. No, you just tell me whether stimulus was wrong or not. So I am asking well, you tonight, why are you not? And I was no, no. I am I am telling you, I am asking all I, the opposition parties, including Sudhakar Reddy, they don't want direct taxes because they kill the incentives. They don't want indirect taxes then because of regressive. They don't want subsidies. Why want, are you? I'll tell you what we want. We no, want no. correct, uh, better management of the economy. We want corruption to stop. They can jolly well auction the 17 billion tons of coal mines that they have given away as what largest. What was your management to, center to, hotel? To, at to what no, price? Relatives of them. No, at what price you sell central well, hotel? That was an international process. No, 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 We did not Let give it, it to some not friend or management. You were it was an international bidding process. Answer the question. Answer, answer the question. You tender. You could have bid for my, it. You could have bid for it. Gentlemen, may I come in? May I come in? Please. The point here tonight is this. That tomorrow morning, and maybe even from 12 o'clock midnight, people will go to petrol pumps all over India and the prices will go up by 7 rupees 50 No, he's already indicated it might come down 1 or 2 rupees. It then doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. That's strategy. It doesn't matter. That may be strategy. It's futile strategy. Everybody will see through it. But it's going to happen. But you can't tell us today. Hmm. And that's my point. That Mr. Rajiv Kumar, nobody can tell us today, I'm so sorry, but I have no other alternatives. I agree. You have other totally. alternatives. You have other alternatives of raising the revenue. And I checked the figures, by Mr. Rajiv Kumar. In fact, if the aggregate exemptions in both direct and indirect taxes are taken into account, it works out to 5,2299 crore as per the Parliamentary Standing Committee on Finance panel. Because you said I was factually wrong. Right? These are corporate Mr. tax Goswami, exemptions. Mr. Goswami, I keep repeating that that particular figure that you are giving includes <clears throat> about 70% <clears throat> of taxes which cannot legally be exported uh, but, and they are on export, export items of this country to which and they are on special economic zones but what, what, what I have to say to you is that yes you can have alternate measures of re raising revenues you but to correct the price distortions in the economy is an absolute essential. So the decision has been taken. Prices, so the so 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 the, what my point to you is at a very large level. <coughs> is the government thinking tonight that we are taking a decision based upon what is, you know, those who we need to keep happy, which is corporate India, and those who are politically expendable, which is middle class, which anyway tonight Mr. Balachandra Mungekar said middle not, class, middle class is not Ahmad. No, 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 you Mr. said middle class Mr. is not Ahmad. That is not absolutely middle class. I'm not saying Ahmad. Me, Mr. Ahmad, me, according to me, the, today the government we, is not trying to keep the corporates happy. My dear friend, the government is trying to do what is the right thing to do. And you and I have I'm been arguing ask, about it, that you've got to take the bold decision. Ask Piyush, Piyush, Piyush is asking you a question. Rajiv, and once they have bitten the bullet, Piyush is asking why are we question. criticizing them? Rajiv, you answer me this. You are saying that it's a signal to the states to reduce taxes. Oil price has not yes. changed internationally in the last 12 months. It was 108 exactly 365 days ago. It's 108 today. But the price to the arm has gone just, up from 58 to 80 rupees. What has happened in the meantime? Ayush, rupee has depreciated 22% because of bad policies of the government which you yourself are criticizing for the last three months, two months. After that, this government I, has an ad valorem tax in the center because of which they increase their taxes by 22%. But we are required to pay that money. It is really Please surprising. make up your mind why the government Let cannot make it specific, specific taxes. Yes, Piyush, I, I, I tried to explain to you that when the dollar uh, crude oil price was 108, our prices had not been raised to the level to cover recover the under recovery. No, they just said and that it's I also explained to you. I also explained to you that 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 this is been done to get ahead of the curve, to to free the to let the prices float, so that when tomorrow the rupee appreciates and the oil prices drop. They can announce the better news. There is of oh, one, 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 one second. One second. I, I just no, 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 question is of question is of timing. No, I, 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 we know Mehta raised his hand. Let me tell you. We know Mehta has raised. I want to go to Vinod. Absolutely, I justify the timing. 
and there is nothing wrong it is government Adnan. prerogative one minute here, here uh, vinod mehta here vinod mehta here vinod mehta one minute here vinod mehta vinod mehta yeah all of us shouldn't think that this government has got a death switch and the government is mad i think when they this 7 rupee 50 paisa hike i refuse to believe that the government did not know what would be the reaction of the aam aadmi to this so what i am mystified by is on top of double digit inflation you put this 7.50 a- a- rupees on petrol and then some things on diesel and L- i mean why would the government at this point of time when it is so unpopular across the country i am trying to understand this is this is such a huge hike or now yeah. what can be the thinking behind this that is what i would uh, so, if anybody can answer that question re- i should all be all very grateful i'm taking what, three what, calls uh, one okay. minute on a departure from news no, no, tonight one one minute one vijay vijay yeah i would like i mean we have been debating all these things are we looking for a solution yep i will give you a simple solution from the point of view of an ordinary indian go on number one why don't we first of all remove reservations in all jobs and allow only merit now here we so are going to the relevant it is no, the it is no, it is, it is out it of the question let us have a separate rise. debate on this no, 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 let's let's as you as you schedule cast and schedule tribe managing no, public no, sector no, 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 i'm i'm what reservation let, let me let no, me gentlemen i draw you back i draw you back i'm not going to discuss the reservation tribe i'm going to take three calls i'm going to take three calls and as i take my first call let me make a point tonight it is not right to say that vegetable prices have gone up by 24% if you are in urban india and here's the most shocking figure in urban india year on year vegetable prices are rising at 32.43% exactly and therefore people are saying tonight that is there any worse time than this is a cruelest joke perhaps on middle class india you say absolutely, middle class is not aam aadmi absolutely me. let me tell you very frankly who takes i repeat the same or now everybody in this country must know caller standard principle of taxation policy there is ability to pay it's it's firms don't want direct tax is not to be us people were opposing even 12 to 10 to 12% service tax where from to get the resources name one country where vegetable prices are going up by 33% year on year you tell one country in the world which is having 1.2 million population sir name one China. country where vegetable prices are going up by 33% you know vegetable well, prices no no no, no year on year vegetable prices 33% but you in know vegetable, vegetable prices sometimes are collapsing government must go for better management sir, it I, is not I, the, i haven't seen the collapse in no, no, the no, no, last five no, years no no it is it is not the case ordinary prices so oil, wh- oil and fat oil prices are going up by 20% my dear friend i, I 8% 9% rain no, growth rajiv, economy rajiv kumar stay on with us no, because people, by the way also watch, watch, i three, thought the revenue foregone I, figures I, what, are, what, they, what, what rajiv Ajab, is saying is completely now. wrong i have to get it on to the channel one second rajiv rajiv kumar one i want you it to it is not revenue foregone on way of first support. caller is I, I our first caller our rajiv first caller is sundar is calling in from chennai rajiv kumar stay on Which is one call. I want you to hear the voices of the viewers of News R tonight. Sundar, what do you think of the present situation as you hear Sir. this debate? Hello. Yeah, go on, Sir, Sundar. Are you hearing? Yeah, with Good you. Morning. Good evening. Good evening. You are hearing? Yup, yup. Yes, on first of March, uh, the rate of crude is one hundred and ten dollars. The rate of crude is one hundred and ten dollars. Yes. Now it is running ninety dollars. That is nearly twenty dollars less than in three months. When the dollar rate twenty dollars when it is going down, what is the need for increasing the rate crude oil? And you make two lakh crores. Why do you have to increase? So now it is running, running, running to ninety dollars. Why you are giving wrong information that it is running one hundred twenty dollars? You are giving wrong information. Right. What that that point? So you, now it is running ninety dollars. Few days it was. Few days it was one hundred twenty dollars. Yes, a valid. What's a Sundar? Thanks for your call. Good point. Okay, one hundred one eighty percent to eighty two percent crude oil imported imported. So two But lakh. That's because also no, 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 of the no, no. inefficiency of this government no, no, no. that they don't allow My the oil and gas sector to produce what it can Let produce. Us see, basically, our second caller is Sham from New Delhi. Sham, you look. The viewers are aware of the facts. <coughs> Sham, I'm very happy that people are enlightened. Good evening, Sham. Sham from New Delhi, you're there. Lost the line with Sham. You see, the people are aware of the facts. That you, is very good thing. Uh, what? One second, one second, one second. I, I'd like to go. I would like to go back. I'd like to go back to Rajiv Kumar. Rajiv Kumar, the fact is, why do you have to increase retail prices? Two lakh crore rupees are made out of duties on fuel. Why does the retail price have to go up each time? 
because despite the fact that 2 lakh crores are made in duties, the fiscal deficit is 5.9% and rising. So and therefore you have to reduce the subsidies. Now the question is, how do you do that? Now I, I accept that there are lots of expenditures that has to be improved. We can, we can do a lot more with the fertilizer subsidy and the diesel subsidy and including the kerosene subsidy, a lot of which uh, goes into adulteration. But for God's sake, let us get ourselves together and say that this is a bullet that has been bitten and this will prove us to be in a, to hold us in a good Sir, stead it's, going down the road. It's fantastic. So why, and the just a minute, just, just one last thing. We have the, all the figures that you've been citing about the vegetables, etc., you know that the Governor of Reserve Bank has said that the prime cause for all of that is the high fiscal deficit and the fiscal profligacy. So why is there if any... If you're not going to correct the fiscal deficit, why is what's wrong with so that?